you want to buy notes then check the link in the comment section and install the app now in this video we will see basic circuit elements symbols so number one is resistor now here we can see this is the symbol for resistor this R represents the value of resistor that is resistance the unit of resistance is ohms which is represented by omega resistor opposes flow of electric current so this is about symbol of resistor which is the basic circuit element then next is capacitor capacitor is represented by this symbol this C represents capacitance which is the value of capacitor the unit of capacitance is farads which is represented by capital F capacitor opposes sudden change in voltage resistor opposes flow of electric current capacitor opposes sudden change in voltage next is inductor this is the symbol for inductor where this L represents inductance which is the value of inductor the unit of inductance or the inductance is measured in Henry's which is represented by capital H inductor opposes sudden change in current capacitor opposes sudden change in voltage inductor opposes sudden change in current so this is the symbol for inductor then next is load resistor this is the symbol for load resistor and it is represented by RL where RL represents load resistance value the unit of load resistor or the unit of load resistance is ohms which is represented by omega load resistor is used and used as electrical load in a circuit so it is a load resistor or electrical load then next is variable resistor now this is the symbol for resistor and if we add a arrow on this then it will be a variable resistor whose value can be varied then next is battery this is the symbol for battery it have two terminals one is positive terminal and second is negative terminal this V represents the value of voltage the unit of voltage is volts which is represented by capital V battery is used an EMF source or DC voltage source so it is a source of EMF EMF stands for electromotive force so this is the symbol for battery then next is variable capacitor similar to variable resistor this is the symbol for variable capacitor just we have to add the arrow on the symbol of capacitor then it will be a variable capacitor here we can vary the value of capacitance then next is AC voltage source AC stands for alternating current so here here we can see a symbol of sine wave which, rep which represents AC so this is the symbol for AC voltage source then next transistor so this is the symbol for transistor next is diode so diode allows the flow of current in one direction and it looks like a arrow so this is the symbol for diode then next is ground so ground is represented by this type of lines and it's it's a reference voltage which have a value of 0 volt so this is the symbol for ground don't forget to like share and subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching